Hello everybody, it is Nicole from Ikiwi, and today I want to teach you three more ways on how to use washi tape in your art. I did a video on this previously, but if you haven't seen that yet, I'll leave a link in the description. So let's not waste any time, grab some paper and some washi tape, and let's hop right into the tutorial. The first way is to add borders to your drawing, similar to how you can add it to a background shape. However, this time, it's more of a simple border than covering the entire background like I showed in my last video. I chose to create a diamond shape around the character, and I tried to add some dimension by making the diamond border go behind her head, but in the front, she is behind the diamond. I think it's a nice way to make the drawing more interesting, and since I tend to draw a lot of random characters, this is something I like to do to give the drawing added interest. Another fun way to add washi tape into your artwork is to actually cut out parts of your washi tape and add it to your drawing, almost like a sticker. For example, in this washi tape, it is an animal and food pattern. I cut out the food parts of the washi tape and add it to the character's bag, as well as in the background using it like stickers. The cut doesn't have to be perfect, and I like to think of it as kind of like a patch, so you can add these stickers on their shirt or a dress or anything you want. If your washi tape has individual patterns that can be cut out, it's a fun way to add some detail into your art. The third way is to take different washi tapes and make a collage out of them. I chose to use washi tapes that came in a pack and they have encouraging phrases on them, but you can use any washi tapes you have. Maybe you want to choose by color, pattern, or theme, but whatever you choose, you can make some fun collages with a different washi tape you may own and it can contribute to a very unique piece. And here's a quick bonus tip for using thin washi tape. If you have thin washi tapes, I think they're great for adding patterns, similar to my previous video where I used the washi tape as clothes patterns. You can use these tapes to make vertical, horizontal, diagonal, or cross lines. I hope you try out some of these tips in your art. I think it's a really fun way to add some interest and sometimes it gives me ideas that I wouldn't normally have. I love to see how you incorporate it into your art, so if you like, you can tag me on Instagram or Twitter at eKiwi. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more videos like this, be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you're notified of when a new video comes out. And if you have any ideas for future videos, please let me know in the comments down below. So with that, I want to thank you all so much for joining me today. Keep drawing, keep creating, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!